morning and night routine COVID edition. I fold up my blanket, put my pillow away, and take down my window coverings. I slide into my front seat and head to my friend's house, who is nice enough to let me shower at her home while my gym is shut down during COVID quarantine. I bring a duffel bag with my toiletries and a travel towel. At night, my routine is basically just the opposite. I put my window coverings up in the front first. They're great for privacy and blacking out my windows. I slide into my back seat elegantly, and I put the back ones up which involves shoving a couple pillows in the back behind the headrest. I change into something comfortable and get my blanket out and hit the hay. Why am I homeless? I've only got a minute to match all this, so bear with me, guys. I've been homeless by definition most of my adult life, and I've even lived in my car before briefly, so I'm not that unfamiliar with being in uncomfortable situations and being homeless. I couldn't afford to go out and get cheap food with friends. I was skipping meals to save money, and I was slowly and steadily going into debt. So I decided to cut my biggest bill out, rent. Money was the biggest factor, but my other motivators were that I like to be minimalistic, I like to be challenged to be resourceful, I like new experiences, and I knew personal growth would come of it. Today I afford to live a happier life because of this lifestyle. So when I say I chose this, I did. I chose it, but it's not that simple. flashlight, batteries, you get the picture. Next is hiking and camping, fog repellent, sunscreen, the boring outdoorsy stuff. The middle is my precious bathroom. It's just typical bathroom items. It's where I keep my full-size bottles to fill my travel bottles with. And I have the necessary first aid kit. What do you know if next isn't just more outdoorsy stuff? A stove, hammocks, the works. This is my kitchen junk drawer, so there's tools, um, a bottle, a plastic bowl, a scrubbing towel, all the miscellaneous. And tucked all the way in the back is a bit of my sweaters. Morning. Spend a day living in a car with me. Now today is an adventure day, but there are still many car life things to attend to. Like this mess. This is what I sleep in. <laughs> Obviously when it's cold outside, the first thing I do is make my bed done. Now I have to move these items from the front to the back so I can get up there. Ordinarily I would change first thing in the morning, but I'm nowhere near a shower that I can use and it's cold outside. So I'm just gonna keep wearing this. The first item on the agenda is to find a public bathroom. Okay, now it's time for a couple errands before the fun stuff. Oh, it does not smell great in here now that I got out and got back in. Okay, now I'm gonna change, so I put my back window coverings up. Day two without a shower means beanie. Let's roll. Take a look at this. This did not look like this at all earlier. It gets like this so quickly. time to eat. I use this plastic steering wheel tray. Now we are on the move. I'm done with adventuring in the national park and I'm en route to Vancouver. You like my rainbows? My hair is super freaking dirty now so it's up and I'm grocery shopping. Grocery shopping. So 
Somebody's chasing somebody. Could you hear them yelling, you can't run from me? Just in one single day, my car looks like this. Disarray is inevitable. Window covers are up. It's time for me to go to sleep. Bye. <laughs>